Okay, Will, do you want to do the next stage, which is the manufacture? Life cycle mapping is a class activity that helps students understand and explore the life cycle of a product. In this exercise, students are broken up into groups, and each group is assigned a different type of product in the same category. These students were asked to map the life cycle of a jumper. One group was given a wool jumper and the other one polyester. Give the students large sheets of paper and then ask them to visually map the life of the product that they have been given. From the extraction of raw materials through to manufacturing, packaging and transportation, use and end of life. At each of these stages, students should make guesses and conduct some basic internet research to find out exactly how their products made. Inputs such as energy, raw materials and water are mapped as well as their corresponding outputs such as carbon emissions, waste materials and even the desired product. Yep. So do you want to go up here to use stage? Oh, we've got lots of arrows and stuff. Yeah, so we just want to the process of mapping the product's entire life encourages students to think about the different environmental impacts that occur across the full life of the product, and it also helps them consider where they might be able to make design changes to help reduce these. It's a bright blue. Okay, so it does look you work out what the next step is? Well, okay, so for a jumper, what are we doing? After we've used your Okay, so that's for more free educational resources on sustainability and design, please go to thesecretlifeofthings.com.